Hello, friendly friends. Hello to you and your face from my face is my face to your face. I hope you're having a good day and a wonderful weekend. Uh, I was planning on shooting at Greg Answers Questions. That's me. I'm Greg and I answer questions um, this weekend, but I don't have time. Why? Because I'm leaving town. I'm leaving town for a week and I just hope that I can quickly upload a bunch of stuff that you guys can see over the next week while my wife and I go on Yep, you guessed it, another cruise with her parents. You see, my wife's parents, the only thing that they really want to do in their retirement is, you know, they just go on some cruises. So there's a cruise that leaves out of Los Angeles. It is a week long. It's 500 bucks for a whole week, including the room, because we just got one of the cheap little rooms, and food and all that. It's just all paid for, and it's, so it's a cheap trip. So we're going to go on this thing. And we're going to stop in Santa Barbara and San Francisco and San Diego and uh, I believe in Mexico. I, they always stop in Mexico. So we're going to be making some more videos on the cruise, some vlogs and silly fun stuff, I hope. Um, but meanwhile, instead of a Greg Answers Questions, I wanted to show you... You? You. I wanted to show you uh, what it was like when we did, uh, about a month or so ago, when we did a live Google Plus Hangout with uh with the pa with a few patreon peeps it's our it was our first time doing it we only had a few people join so i figured ah you know what we have this video it was live just for them at the time but now if you guys want to see what it's like you can see it um i'm going to do a, a live hangout every month just for the people who are supporting me on patreon if you want you can go and join that and you can uh join us live and ask questions and i'll answer you and all that kind of fun stuff but anyway, so here's the video. It's really long. Watch some of it. Skip through. Whatever you want to do. Just don't miss this part. Wow, look at that. He's just, look at that. He's moving. <laughs> it's kind of funny. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's a good part. Okay, hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, oh, here's one more thing I want to remember to tell you. I am going to be in New York City for the first time in years. Uh, StreamCon is flying me and Kim out there to appear at StreamCon because that's the StreamCon. That's why they're flying us out. It's like VidCon, but it's in New York. It's the East Coast YouTube convention. I've never been. At, no one's been. It's their first year. So uh, that is Halloween weekend. So if you're in New York and you want to stop by and meet me and some other hopefully fun, friendly people, then please do. I'm, I'm going to be there. I'm going to be speaking on a panel and having some fun. This is going to be a, the longest video I've ever put up. This is well over half an hour. It's crazy. Anyway, enjoy guys, and I hope to meet you in New York, and if not, then I do not hope to meet you in New York. Okay, goodbye. Now I think we're live. Now I think that's what's happening is I think we're live. All right, so hang on a second. This The live stream actually is like 30 seconds behind what we're doing. So you better not watch it or you'll just right. confuse yourself. I know we have a couple of people here. What we're going to do is we're going to make sure there's an, echo. That there's an echo. We don't want there to be an echo. There's an echo? So we're working this out. That's what someone said. Probably because Let's you have see. that open. You know, maybe I need to, uh, let me see if I need to reload this. Okay. Now. Is that muted? Okay, so here we go. Now, hi everybody, I'm Greg Benson. This is my lovely wife, Kim Evie Benson. And this is my other lovely wife, Mr. Miles Groves. Okay, so this is a... Uh, so, so let us know in the comments. We're actually looking at your comments now. Let us know if you can see us and hear us clearly and if, there's, if there are any issues with echo or whatever. Uh, I see that the Palm Office here and James Panto are here. Hello. The palm off. Is that Alex? Is Alex the palm off? Oh, not an echo on you, Greg. An echo in the posts. Aha. Okay. Good to know. So whatever you guys type to us, uh, I think that we see it pretty much right away. But then you hear our reply, I think about 30 seconds later, because there's a delay for some reason. So feel free to Okay, so James says, hi, Kim. Hi, Miles. Hi, Greg. I love all you guys. Now, I'm going to see if I... Oh, Jay Frosting is here. Thanks, Looks Jay. and sounds good. Jay is here. I'm going to see if I can actually make these... Jay Frosting. Good old Jay Frosting is here. Oh, sorry. 
lot of waving. There's some waving. Some waving's happening. Okay, I think I think now we're actually set to do. This is it. This is this is it, folks. This is the first annual. Not annual. It's the first, the first annual. This is only first, happening once a year. We do this once a year. This is our first monthly Patreon Google Plus Hangout. Hey, Greg. It is okay. Good. So it's so we have Alex J and James. I don't know if we have anybody else who, for some reason, can't type comments. If there's anybody else here, it says three viewers. But if there is anybody else here where it says say something, you can type your comments. Yeah, don't just watch and don't say anything. That's a little creepy, right? That's a little creepy. That's a little creepy. Are you? Can you see? Hang on a second. Are you in there? There. We're gonna get you in there more. There you go. Now we're all in there. Did you all three wear gray shirts on purpose? Actually, yours is gray. Yours is gray. Mine is greenish. Yeah, gray a patch of green. I did. I but, totally wore this shirt on purpose. When yeah. I got up in the morning, yeah. I was like, "I'm going to put on that gray shirt." When uh, when I woke up this morning, I said, "I'm going to put on a light orange, orangeish shirt with like a smiley face on it." And then I wore this one, so I don't know what happened. I'm colorblind. Uh, oh, and of course, hey Kim and Miles says Alex. Hey Alex says Kim. Hi, um, hi Alex. Says Miles. I just remember that that was Alex because you have a very recognizable. You know, avatar. So you're wearing sunglasses indoors. Is it because you're cool? Yeah. Um, no, it's because I'm not wearing any makeup. Oh yeah. All right. That, well, that's a, that's a good way to do it. Um, today's uh, live stream is brought to you by Dusty Muffins. Dusty Muffins. When you feel like saying that today's stream is brought to you by someone who it actually isn't. This is this is batter filled Dusty Muffin milk chocolates. I don't know what these are, but tell the story of how we got all this Saturday Night Live, all these Saturday Night Live things. So we, we went into this candy shop that sells, uh, they have a, an SNL 40-year anniversary <coughs> display of, of all the weird novelty items that they've had on the show. But apparently uh, they didn't sell well. And when we got there, they didn't have the display. So we asked, do you still have any of those items? And they said, yeah, we're almost giving them away. Would you like everything that we have in stock? And Greg's like, yeah, give us everything. So... Every they all these things that they had things that normally sell sold for like forty bucks and whatever it, it was all they all marked down to a dollar each like this these things are normally like forty bucks look it's it's the talking ladies man how do you make him talk you punch him in the face yeah threat him. I don't no, think I that's what you do what do you do how do you, you, how do you make him talk you, you got to open him up and then you... no wait a minute oh hang on there's a thing in here wait a minute yeah, it's in the back. All right, see, so these were this, these were a dollar. Yeah. I don't know why that didn't sell. Yeah, who wouldn't want a huge talking ladies man? Apparently, head? a lot of people. And there's all, we also got that one over there. Yes, the, but I figured this would be a good, even less popular character. Debbie Downer, ladies and gentlemen, is she less popular? No, actually, but she didn't get her own movie. Overpriced pedicure at the hotel, fifty dollars. Quick dry top coat, five dollars. A raging scab infection under my left toenail. Priceless. Takes a little long to develop. Hey, does this show have strobes? Because I did not bring my seizure meds. I really don't know what I'm, I bought these things. I don't really know what I'm going to do with them, but they were they were a dollar. They're collector's items. And so were these dusty muffins. Get a whiff of that. Florence Dusty's Dusty Muffins, 100% cherry free. Was there any colon blow cereal? You know, they, I think that they normally have it, but do that, we? That was sold. That was gone. That was gone. They had a bunch of great stuff. The, the good stuff was gone. And but this, was like, this is some chocolate thing. There's four dusty muffins in here, and I'm guessing that this is edible. It's been sitting around for a long time, for months probably. Do you want to try one? I know you don't. I know you don't do chocolate. Oh, it's it's still it hasn't expired. It doesn't expire until um, November 22nd of this year. So, what is it? What's in it? Chocolate. <laughs> mm -hmm. No. Mm. It's good. You want to bite? Oh. It's got poop in it. Okay. We don't have SNL in the UK, so all is lost on me. Uh, all right. It, Saturday Night Live. It it it, uh, it spawned, you know, John Belushi and Chevy Chase and Bill Murray and Eddie Murphy. Mm -hmm. Sketch comedy show. Not as good as Monty Python. But. There are a lot of people there. Who are regulars who are so good? It's where Leonardo DiCaprio got his start. No, 
The Mormon Tabernacle Choir mm -hmm. started on there. Never appeared on there. Bill Clinton, before probably. he became president, he was a regular on that show. He guessed it, probably. Um, who else? Oh, all NFL football players were regulars. They were all comedy regulars there. A few made appearances, probably not regulars. Mm -hmm. They were good. Listen, my friend, I know that you... What? I know that you cannot enjoy the chocolate. Yeah. Or don't enjoy the chocolate. I don't like it. So Too chocolatey. So we have a little something else for you. Oh, no. Here, come sit here for a second. Come sit here. Talk to these people for a minute. We got we Miles a, a special surprise. A little surprise for you. Oh, no. Because he's our friend. Buddy, Wait, did you know here. that Miles married us? Come on. Yes. Stay here, right here. They gave me the honor of, uh, I went online and was Stay ordained, here. and I married them on a beach. Now. And I'm frightened. Keep right looking here. at the screen and talking to these people. All right. I'm going to surprise you with a little something. Okay. Hang on. The Mars. You guys keep talking. Over. It, it could have. The Mars Curiosity rover could have gotten its start on SNL, says James. I don't know. I, I can't substantiate that. And uh, Cowbell. Yeah. You guys, it, get ready for a couple hours of this. <laughs> this is going to be good viewing. Wait, you have to do this for two hours? I don't know. You know Greg. Oh, I yeah. do know him. He's my husband. That's true. Woo! Well. Um, so what are you people doing right now? What, what's What's fun? Okay, something's happening behind me. Nothing's happening. Don't Nothing. look. Okay. Don't look. I, but Don't he's look. right. I can look. see you. Hey. This is weird. Wow, look at that. He's just, look at that. He's moving. Hey. <laughs> it's kind of frightening. Hey. <laughs> oh, look at that. That's cool. You got one of those things. Who did? Hey. You do. Who? He's getting, no, he doesn't. But look, look, look! He's like floating. He's he floating. floats. Look at that. <laughs> no, there will not be a live reenactment of Batty Bat Bat. No, that that hurt. And look at this thing, man. So, look at that. Look at that. This belongs to my friend Miles. That's for you. It's a top. What that's, do you mean it's for me? That's for you. No Why is it for me? Because it, because you, you get to own that now. Yeah. Why? Because you want it. <laughs> I don't want it. Yes, yes you, you do. do. Yes, you do. It's like a segue, but without a yeah, handlebar. That is for you, my it's friend. It's a big tie. Yeah. Why is this for me? Because it's for you. We because, you. here's why. Because a company... You know, these are made in China. You guys have seen these things before. They're just like, no one knows what to call them. Some people call them hoverboards. But they're not hoverboards. They don't hover. It's a tie. So It's not a tie. No, no, it's not a tie. But really, they're like two-wheeled electric hands-free scooters. That's what they are. So these are scooters. These are electric scooters. They sell anywhere from like $400 to $1,700. But really, they're all the exact same thing. They're made in China. They're all almost identical. And uh, one company that's distributing these contacted me and said, hey, we want you to make a video using these things. And I said, okay, if you send me three of them, I'll make a video. And Kim and I get one, and you get the other one. Oh, well, thank you very much. So now you have one of these. I, I have one of these. I didn't know I was getting one of these. This, this is pretty cool. <laughs> that's pretty cool, right? Yeah. That's a bonus because people are following us and supporting us on Patreon. It's thank a bonus you. for you. I can't Not you guys, but for him. I can't wait to my first serious injury from this. Greg has one. Show him your alley. It's the give. My, oh, here's this is my first injury from this yesterday. Oh. I, I had I, I did I did fall once. Oh, I'm looking and forward I, to that. I smashed my. You just have to be careful. I got cocky. He <laughs> he, he was racing with some new chillins in our cul-de-sac. I love that James said it's the give miles the things we don't need anymore celebration. Here's the thing though. We we do. I've been so excited to get one of these things and ride around on this. And, and I've been I was practicing last night. Kim just barely got on it. But after we do this, I think we're going to do a live periscope where we're all going to go outside and try it. And all injure ourselves. Mm -hmm. So if you guys have periscope, um, then go check out the mediocre films periscope. There will be a link from my Twitter where you can see this video. I actually couldn't figure it out because when you put one foot on it. At least the way I was doing it, that's the foot that goes. <laughs> so yeah, like this, and then you put your foot on it, and it goes. I love this idea of Alice's get a long coat and float around like Nosferatu. That's actually a really funny idea. Like if you had a long coat that sort of went out and covered it up, and you just sort of like had a scary 
and you just sort of float it around. Oh, I, I, that's a great idea for yeah. a video. So you said a cloak. A cloak. I, I know that's what I meant. I meant a cloak. Well, he likes to wear. That's what I meant. Is I you're gonna get a nice long cloak. This would be. seem. Oh, you want, you want me to be in the middle? Yeah, it looks better. Be. Ah. All right. Um. So I hope you enjoy your new gift. I hope you get a lot of usage out of it. Yeah, thanks. These things are heavy. They're like 26 pounds. They are. Um, so uh, that that's the big surprise. That was very nice. From this thing. That, that, that's amazing. Do you enjoy it? Yep. So you guys, you guys are here, and there's only, it looks like there's only three of you. I think there was four of you, but it looks like there's only three of you now. Um, I, I figured that some people just wouldn't tune into this, but you are here because you supported us on Patreon, and man, we appreciate this. This is awfully cool of you guys. Anything that you want to ask, anything that you want to know, you have any questions for for any of us, you have any questions for Buddy? Buddy's here. I'm going to show you Buddy. Buddy's right here. Hi, good boy. Hey, he's He's pretty deaf he's now. He's asleep. 14 and a half, and he's... He's asleep. The Buddy. The Buddy. Hi, boy. Oh, the Buddy. Who the boy? Who the Buddy? Oh, he's a good boy. Yeah, he's a good buddy. Oh, the buddy. He's the buddy. So, you know, if you have it's any... It's very intimate. It is intimate, isn't it? Picking well, this up? you know, they say if you can reach only one person, then you probably should stop the broadcast. Yeah. But, there are, but there are three, so, you know, you keep going. And now there's four. It says four oh, viewers. That's exciting. So I know that we have Jay, Alex, and James. Our fourth person has not... Uh, left a comment yet. So uh, if you are the fourth person, feel free to let us know that you exist. If you can leave a comment where it says, say something, um, we would love to hear from you. Um, Jay Frosting wants to know, will Kim do a shopping list prank? Why not? You wouldn't like to do that? They're fun. You've never done one, right? Would you do one in character? As I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I go back and forth. Like I mean, really, it depends on the day that you catch me. Some days I go, you know, what would be a good idea? I should like do a shopping list prank in character. But mm. that's like maybe two days out of three hundred and sixty-five days. So you have to catch me on one of those two days. James Panda says we're growing by leaps and bounds. I would love it if you do a shopping list prank. You know, we talked before about you doing a prank as your. Uh, Korean lady in a visor character. Yeah. Can you do a little of that character for us? No. Please? I don't know what she talks like. Yes, you do. No. Shame about the numbers. You don't have to stay on my behalf. No, no, we're totally what? staying. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Alex. We're totally staying for uh, for the 30 minutes. I mean, you guys can tune out anytime you want, but there are four of you here. There are four of you here right now. Please don't leave. Don't leave. Please don't leave. It's okay. If you need to leave, you can leave. This is just for this is just for Patreon. This is just for you guys. It's like every month from now on should get larger and larger. I think there I, I, honestly I think there were only eight or nine people invited to this because that's how many people had had paid the, the minimum. So it's just this, a little party. Yeah, it's just a small party. This so, is like this is like um, the sketch comedy that we used to do. Oh man together in front of an audience of there are more of you probably than in front of a lot of the audiences. So we all met at the Acme Comedy Theater in Hollywood. That's where we all met, and, and the three of us fell in love. And uh, I don't think it's wrong to say that we all fell in love with each other. It could be misinterpreted. No, I mean sexually. Yeah, that, that's yeah. exactly how they could misinterpret <laughs> um, Yeah, so uh, if we would often perform, and you know, there might be 10 or 8 or 10 people who are actors in the show, or more, and only three or four in the audience. What are you doing? Are you, gonna, are you about to bite me? No. Were you going to bite me? No. Yeah, you were going to bite me, weren't you? I think you were going to bite me. All right, we have a couple more comments and questions. <laughs> Stop it! Oh. <laughs> you know, you know women, they love to bite. No, 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 no more biting. No more. I see you. No, no, no more. Uh, okay, so let's see what else they're saying here. Shame about the network. We did that. Yeah, we need more Kim involved videos. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, Ouch. Yeah. If she's going to bite. <laughs> man. You don't want to. Yeah, I guess if we have her, like, if we set her loose at a target, then she just starts to bite. <laughs> <laughs> that would be bad. 
Uh, Miles, what brings you to California? You've been there a little bit now. Yes. Well, I lived out here before. Uh, I'm, I'm from New York, but I was out here and I met them, and which was wonderful. But then I moved back to New York because I missed, you know, food. Must not have been that wonderful. Yeah. It was very wonderful. You know, we've got food here. Yeah, man, pizza and bagels. We got pizza and bagels here. They are the best pizza and bagels in the world. Look at this. We got these dusty muffins. Look at these. Mmm. Mm. So, you know, I was in New York. But then I missed I missed them, and I missed coming out here and having nice weather. So, uh, yeah, I flew back out here. No, we drove back out here. Drove all the way across the country. Me and my, and my, my fiance at the time, my wife now, and her stepdaughter, and a cat, all in a little vehicle with lots of stuff. But now we're out here. Did you let the cat drive? A little bit late at night. It's a good driver. Mm -hmm. Swerves a bit, but you know, well, cat. His can't reach the pedals yeah. very well. Mm. They get distracted. You got to get those really long pedals so that the cat can reach them. Yeah, or long cats. Jay Frosting asks if you could put copyrighted music in a video, what would your number one song pick be? Miles. Uh. Well, because I talked the safety dance, because. Uh, I was in uh, Austin over the weekend, and with the men with or without hats. Oh, they don't have hats. They don't have hats. Men uh, without hats. Yeah, they performed, uh, and they did that song, um, uh, along with their other hits, that song. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Many times. They performed it 11 times. 11 times. Um, I think that if I were going to put a, a copyrighted song in a video, there's a very a kind of obscure song from Asia, one of the Asian countries, um, that I think could use some more exposure. It's called Gangnam Style. I think I'd try that. I think I might try that. I think I saw a video with that. I don't know if it's been used in a video yet. I think so. Um, or just something by, I, I use a lot of James Brown music, actually. Do you have an answer? What music would you use? Yeah, I just use that Asia song, Heat of the Moment. Heat of the Moment? Well, it was the Heat of the Moment. Yeah, it was. James Panto says, the videos when Greg went to New York City to see Miles were great. I agree. They were great. Good times. That theme song gets stuck in my head every once in a while, too. James, I'm glad that you mentioned that. What a nice segue. That's a nice segue, because I have just this past week released the Greg Benson Comedy Music album on Patreon, and you... No, no, no biting. Stop it. <laughs> ow, ow. <laughs> So I've just released the, the album, the comedy music album on Patreon. It's called The Genesis of Greg Benson. And that song, Back in NYC, is on the album. If you're watching this, then you qualify for the album. So let me know. Let me know. Like, did you guys actually get the download? Did I email you? Because I meant to email everybody. But it's very confusing how Patreon works and how you, <laughs> how you um, send out the rewards. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen thing. No. No, Cousin It. Cousin It. Cousin It thing is... You keep calling oh, it yeah. thing. No, 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 I just meant your John Carpenter's The Thing. I know. You said that the other day. <laughs> <laughs> it's not true. That's pretty good. Mwah. So, um, yeah, so let me know if you guys actually did get that album, The Genesis of Greg Benson. And it's a very if not, funny album. Greg, Greg will you. say it's a funny album because he did it, but he'll say it half-heartedly, but I, I listened to it. And it's really funny. Thanks, Thanks man. man. Very funny. I, I enjoy it. I, I really want for people to hear it. I haven't had any. Oh, Alex said um two songs. No, no, those are the bonus MP3s of the month. Those are those are not on the album. Those two songs, Alex, are just the bonus MP3s that went out to everybody. But you know what? I obviously did not, or you did not receive the link for the album. So Alex didn't. James didn't. Shit. Oh, oh. He, James did get his Geek a Week card. Good. The card was very sweet. Nice. Glad you got that. I got them. They were great. Voice of an Angel. I got them. Oh, Alex, you got them. When you say you got them, you mean you got those two songs. But I don't think that you got the album, which has 40 tracks. It's called The Genesis of Greg Benson. It has 40 tracks. It's 36 minutes long. So I obviously need to send out the email again. Guys, watch your email addresses. Yeah, watch your emails today. I'm going to send out the links again. And make sure that you got them because I don't think they went out to everybody. I'm not going to use the the Patreon system this time. I'm just going to email it out from one of my email addresses. Um, yeah, so Alex says, oh, I didn't know of an album. Yeah, I need to send you that album. <laughs> How you doing, It? Good. 
you're adorable. Even with hair all in your face, you're adorable. I mean, am I wrong? Or is this lady adorable? He's adorable. That, that's not, that, that, something bad just happened. See, it's a 40, 40, as in 40 tracks. Wow. Here's the deal, though. When I say there's 40 tracks, keep in mind there's 40 tracks, but the album itself is 36 minutes long. Some of the songs are very, very short. Some of the songs are as short as six seconds long. I think that's the shortest, like five or six seconds. And he means that. Yeah, there are there are some very, very short songs. I just wanted to move in like you did. I'm going to, you know what I'm going to do? What? I'm going to sing them a song live right now. Oh, would you? Hey, gonna, gentlemen. I, no, no, they don't even have to ask. I'm just going to do it. I'm going to do a real short one for you. Then gentlemen, Greg Benson. Come on, baby, let's meet where the sour turn to sweet. Grab a knife and cut up feet where the sour turn to sweet. <sighs> That's the opening song, which is just a very short little little opening. That's for you guys. Despite that, it really, it really is but a good album. Besides out. that, it's much better. It's it, 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 get, it gets much funnier after that, hopefully. Uh, James Pando says, I'm very excited to get the album. Your songs aren't long, but they are catchy as heck. First of all, you don't need to curse at us. You know, there's, we don't need the cursing. No, we need the cursing. We need some cursing is what I was going to ask you. If you could add some cursing. Yeah. Yeah. Spices things up. Yeah, it does spice it up a little bit. Um, Jay Frosting asks, who's your favorite Kardashian and why? Craig. I think it's Craig Kardashian. Yeah. yeah it's my favorite. He's a distant cousin, and he's uh, an accountant in Phoenix. I just think he does a really good job for his clients. And he's sexy. He's a little sexy guy. He's got, he's got the booty. Oh, man. Kim's beautiful. Oh, Alex says uh, Kim Kardashian is beautiful. Yeah. I guess that's what... It's what he was talking about, huh. right? Huh. Or maybe you were talking about this, Kim, with these faces. Oh, look, there's a bite of the dusty muffin left. Oh, stop eating that. What, it's chocolate. Ooh, it's really yucky. Why is it yucky? It's, it's chocolate. Oh, I like it. Not good. No, it's good. It's chocolate. I see all these ladies wearing their hair like this. It's a good Kim question. Sorry, Greg, you've got competition. James Pando says, so, I know you guys can't do Gorgeous Tiny Chicken Machine Show anymore because of Sony. Glad you understand that. But what happened to Two Hot Girls in the Shower, Kim? Well, Julie Wittener, my other hot girl in the shower, is still a professional actoress, and she often goes out for actoressing parts in um for things like the disney channel and um the disney other channel and abc disney and all the other channels cbs disney cbs disney and sometimes she goes out for those nbc disney shows mm -hmm. so she uh felt uncomfortable having them uh, accessible because she's playing a lot of moms so uh did you say mams moms. So. i think you said mams very uh, Midwestern. <laughs> yes, so she. Ah! <laughs> oh, <laughs> um, <laughs> so I took them down because she asked me to. Which made me sad because I love that show. Well, the funny thing is, I told Julie, you know, if you Google Julie Whitner, it's probably still going to come up in like some sort of still or something because it's really hard to just wipe anything off the internet. So, in fact, I'm going to Google it right now and see what comes up. All right. On, on, on the other computer, she's going to Google that. So, so, once again, Disney is the cause for joy being just destroyed. No, no, Disney creates joy. No, in this case. They, I don't know. I don't know what you're referring to, but I know that once we again, all love Disney and they create joy. Jeff Miller sent me a message. He wants to know if the links came out. The links, what, to this? To this live thing? No, just to the, the, the um, thing. <laughs> uh, James says, oh, that's too bad. You should come up with a new video series, Kim. You know, here's the thing about Kim. It's, as you can tell, it's sometimes difficult for me to talk her into performing. It's like, she's, I think that, correct me if I'm wrong, sweetie, but you sort of view your life as a performer as like in the past and now you're just really into producing. Is that, is that about right? Well, no, because now I view my life as a producer in the past as well. Now I view myself as just a person who sits around and eats bonbons and dusty muffins. That's not true. You don't, you're not eating dusty muffins and you don't eat bonbons. And she's been producing for us. So one thing that you guys may not know is that um, I know that Jay Frosting knows this because he's been editing these videos for us. Jay is 
Oh, yeah. Right. I just burped. That was um, Dusty, Muff Dusty Muffin. That was brought to you by Jay Dusty Muffin. <laughs> that burp was brought to you by Dusty Muffins. Jay is our editor. Jay edits. And he shoots sometimes. Yes. He shoots a lot of videos. Shoots, he, he shoots videos for us and edits them. Jay is awesome, and we love Jay. Throws um, out funny lines. Yep. And he said he had to take today off because he had to do something. And now I realize what he had to do was watch this live from his own home. Yeah, you don't take off from work and then, like, tweet in live to work or whatever you do. I don't know. I'm old. <laughs> uh, does every U.S. celeb have to do time at Disney? Maybe. Yeah. Maybe, Alex. Um, it's good when you get your time done when you're young, like uh, Brittany then you can go on to a successful career after that, like she did. By the way, I noticed it's 329. I think that this automatically is going to stop at 330. Because um, really? I, 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 well, I put in a start, and like I said, I said start at 3, stop at 330. So I don't know if it will automatically stop. I think, I think we should go over like two minutes or something just to make sure that we could just stop whenever we want to. But maybe it'll stop on its own. That's just a warning to you guys that this might just cut off in the next minute uh, or so. Then what will you do? I mean, you know, this has been such, such 30 minutes worth of entertainment. This what has are you going to really do with good. the rest of your day? Well, I can tell you what they're going to do. They're going to get on They're going to get on Periscope and they're going to watch you learn how to ride this special board. Wow. So if you've never seen the inside of an emergency room, <laughs> this is the day to watch. <laughs> are you, do you really not want to do it? Because this is... Yeah, I'll give it a shot. We will start slow. Yeah. If Greg can learn how to do it, anybody can learn how to do yeah, it. Yeah, I've he got poor wow. balance. I've got poor balance. I've got a bad ankle and I've got a bad knee. And I had a hip replacement when I was 37 years old. So I've just, my lower extremities are really weak and messed up. And I can still ride around on this thing. Cut to me in an ambulance. <laughs> I hope not. I would feel, tell I'd feel terrible. You giggle a little. I, yeah, well, we'd get a, we'd, <laughs> We get a very popular uh, Periscope in the ambulance because, like, live from the ambulance, everybody would watch that. That's a good show, live. Live from the ambulance. We should get an ambulance. Great sketch good. show in the States. Alex says the Segway thing was a highlight. I think that Alex enjoyed you getting, you know, your nice surprise. I did, too. I didn't expect that. It's wonderful. I've been so excited. You know, we knew this was coming for a couple of weeks, and it took a couple of weeks to reach us. Uh, James says, getting to meet you at Dragon Con was such a joy. I hope you find a way to get back in their good graces. No biting. No biting. Uh-uh. He didn't write no biting. Are you kissing? You're sucking? I'm now, drooling, apparently. Now I'm all wet. <laughs> Sorry. I'm all wet. <laughs> That's my wife's drool right there on my shirt. Uh, James, it was great meeting you too, man. And I, uh, I, you know, I think that I could go back to Dragon Con. I just wouldn't be a special guest. But I think I'm allowed to go there and just, just buy a ticket and go. Yeah. But I've already gone twice. It's it's a long way to go just for something that like we already have out here. We have Kamikaze, we have Comic Con, we've got WonderCon. I just don't feel that I need to go back to Atlanta. It's because Greg's not like a true nerd. If, yes, it's if true. He were I mean, I understand. I think he understands too. We both understand why Dragon Con is awesome. Dragon Con is completely it's awesome. Completely unique among cons. And I have a great like I've had the best barbecue and soul food and stuff in Atlanta and I, I really I like it I like the town the people are friendly I just don't feel that I need to go there uh, oh Alex says would you guys ever film in the UK the answer is absolutely I would love to go there um, we don't I think we have an opportunity to go to the UK that I know of but we try to take out the take up these opportunities to, to take free trips and like uh, there's a thing called StreamCon, which is the VidCon of New York and they're flying us to New York well, me and Kim, sorry, I'm not flying you. Hey, but you you have this. You oh, have yeah. this. Hey, tie. Look at that. There you go, it's your fancy tie, 26 pound tie. All right, so. Oh, well, I've never been to the UK, so I would actually like to go. To yeah, no, I would love to go. It would be, it would be so much fun. Jay, you know that I'm 100% British. Like eventually, in the past, you know, maybe. Maybe in the past, I, was, I don't know. Okay, we, we're now three minutes over. Thank you for watching, guys. Thank you so much for supporting us on Patreon. You guys are awesome. And I hope that you had fun. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for coming to hang oh, out. This is a pleasure. Look what I got. So I, I see that um, uh, James Panto will be watching us in four silence on the Periscope website. We will be on in just a few minutes over on Periscope, riding around. Did, did you answer everything what? everybody wanted to do? I, th I think we did. I think we answered everything. All right. All right we'll see you guys again oh, next month, hopefully. If we didn't, it doesn't send it. So it's too late because... Oh, and don't forget, 
Uh, Greg answers questions. We want you guys to submit your questions uh, to the, uh, you know, to, to Patreon. Just submit your questions there uh, because I'm shooting a Greg answers questions probably on Friday and I could use more questions. Ask me some silly questions. There's some serious ones up there. Not that many silly ones. Ask me, oh, ask me whatever you like, but go ahead and put, put a bunch up there and, and we'll have some more to choose from. Stop biting me!